Ever wondered how airlines plan and schedule their flights? It's a fascinating process that involves a strategic blend of science, economics, and a dash of foresight. At the heart of this process is airline network planning and scheduling, a meticulous procedure which dictates where airlines fly, how frequently they do it, and what type of aircraft they use. This process is far from random. It's a careful balancing act that considers a multitude of factors. Think about it. Customer demand, competition, operational constraints, and the overarching airline strategy are all crucial elements that need to be accounted for. And it's not just about getting from point A to point B. It's about understanding the routes that are most profitable, the flights that are in high demand, and the type of aircraft that's best suited for each journey. In essence, airline network planning is a complex puzzle that airlines must solve in order to optimize their operations. Now, you may be curious about how this process unfolds. Well, let's break it down. Airline network planning starts with a crucial step, market research. This is where airlines assess the demand for travel. They study passenger trends, identify popular destinations, and analyze the competition. They need to understand where travelers want to go and who else is offering to take them there. Once they've gathered all this data, they move on to strategic planning. This is the stage where airlines decide which routes to prioritize. It's a delicate balance of meeting customer demand and maximizing profitability. They might focus on popular routes or perhaps they'll find a niche in underserved markets. Every airline has its own strategy, tailored to their unique strengths and goals. Next comes the scheduling. Airlines need to decide not just where but when and how often to fly. They have to consider peak travel times, airport slots, and the types of aircraft in their fleet. It's like a giant 3D puzzle where every piece needs to fit perfectly. And lastly, we have iteration. This isn't a one-off process. Airlines must continuously adjust their plans based on changes in the market and operational constraints. They react to shifts in demand, new competition, and unforeseen challenges like weather disruptions or global events. So as you can see, airline network planning is a dynamic process that requires constant adaptation and strategic thinking. It's a fascinating dance of data, strategy, and logistics, all aimed at getting you where you need to go. To summarize, Airline network planning and scheduling is an intricate process. It's a balancing act, juggling various factors like flight frequency, aircraft size, and timing, all while adjusting to the ever-changing market dynamics. This meticulous planning isn't just about getting planes in the air. It's a strategic game of chess that shapes an airline's operations and competitive edge. So the next time you board a flight, remember the strategic planning that went into getting you to your destination.